it's, it's really it's it's, it's, it's the 800 block of Northwest Forest Street, and it's uh it's basically uh, all these buildings are, are joined together. All these this one building is, is all one building with one width with one little gap on the end, and then there's another separate building on the east end of the block. But other than that, on the Forest Street side of this block. That entire side is essentially involved. So it's it's a large area. Now you can't see the back side of this right now, but there's a lot of fire on the back side too, where that rescue was made. Uh, they're still dealing with a lot of fire back there. From what they told us, again, there were all kinds of things in there. They mentioned furniture. They mentioned props for theater production and costumes and props and, and, and furniture alone, and costumes too, rather are extremely flammable. They, they would produce, if there were a lot of them, as they said there was, that, that means that's a very heavy fire load. And so what that means is there's a lot of fuel inside. So again, we have a lot of personnel still here. This is now what we call a defensive operation. So we're fighting this fire from the exterior. Uh, we are intermittently sending firefighters inside on the west end of the building because about a quarter of the building is still, has still been protected by our crews. So uh, again, we're, we're, we're saving what we can, uh, but the, the bulk of the building at this point is a loss and everything inside would be a loss. Uh, but the great news is one person left. Now, we don't know who, who it was or why why she would have been inside it, other than the fact that this building is being used to lease equipment. So I'm not sure if she's an employee with that theater company or not. No details on her or her condition other than she was talking to our firefighters and they felt like just having the conversation that they had with her to probably, probably, hopefully just some smoke inhalation and we're hoping she'll be okay. Um, and I stay uh, near Northwest 39th Pennsylvania so I can see the smoke literally above my apartment. So I knew it was over here so I came over here and, and it was just big, I mean big and golf flames and I just see the stuff just start falling down one by one. I was uh, probably coming up I saw the place, I mean the building fully engulfed. Um, the building pretty much fell down uh, because of how strong the fire was pretty much.